Colorado's marijuana industry is about to have some new competition in close quarters. New Mexico is set to start selling recreational marijuana next year. Denver 7's Jason Grenauer looks at how that will impact a small southern Colorado town. Colorado's cannabis industry could lose some money to our southern neighbor. The governor of New Mexico recently enacted a measure to legalize recreational marijuana in that state. While Colorado has had legalized pot now for years, a lot of dispensaries still heavily rely on tourists. Trinidad in southern Colorado has more than two dozen pot shops, with business mainly coming from out-of-state visitors. Denver 7 spoke with the general manager of the Other Place is Greener dispensary in Trinidad, who told us he's very worried about what New Mexico's new market will mean for ours. 45% came from Texas, 20% came from uh, New Mexico. When New Mexico does go legal, we will literally be cut off at the pass, Raton Pass. They'll, they'll have no reason to continue driving through New Mexico. New Mexico's legislation also allows people to smoke or consume products in public without fear of penalty. Colorado allows for some social consumption, but cities and municipalities can pass ordinances to prohibit it. Evans says those ordinances could make or break the future of cities like Trinidad. Trinidad has been a boom bust city, and right now we're in a boom, and we need to be doing everything we can to not bust, and that is getting ahead of these other states. Since recreational pot sales began in 2014, Colorado has brought in billions of dollars in tax revenue, and businesses have sold more than $10 billion in products. New Mexico's legal pot market is expected to launch next year.